Hey y'all, I'm Betsy from Happily Ever After Etc. And I'm back for another Plan With Me video. If you have been following my channel, you know that I've missed a couple weeks, y'all. Just like one week, two weeks, three weeks. <laughs> and my camera has been messing up. I filmed this week, I filmed this week, and both of the files got corrupted. And so I didn't even attempt to, to film this week because my camera just, I could not figure out what was wrong with it. So hopefully we have it figured out now because that's three weeks gone. I do have the blog post up on my, my blog, but um, it's just not the same as a video. It's just, you know, the end picture. So enough about that hopefully this will work and if not we will be in the market for a new camera so we are going to get right into this week so this week we actually have quite a bit going on because my gift guide is going live tomorrow and I've been working on it all day I'm pretty happy with how the um pictures have been turning out. I cannot think of the word y'all. I was like, what's the thing with the camera and the clicking and the pictures? The word is pictures. So this week I'm using a kit from White Deer Stationery and it's very pretty. It has this kind of rose gold look, which you guys know is my, my thing. And um, it's a very, I don't want to say small kit because I'm pretty sure it's her mini kit. So I think you can get more pages. I don't remember. I bought this one a long time ago back when I wasn't doing as many kits you know back when I was like still a sane sticker person so I actually had to go back and get the deco sheet because when I got this I didn't realize it had deco but that's okay so we're just gonna hop right in I did pull like a whole stack of stickers that I have not been using lately which makes me very sad like last week we had inventory on Wednesday so everything this week was just crazy that's why I made the washi go up higher everything is smaller I haven't done as much this week which is fine it just was very busy at work so I couldn't blog quite as much um, but that means this weekend that I've been working and this next week are going to be just a little crazier, I think. Hopefully. I've been trying to get caught up. Ooh, I like this paper. It's matte, but it's very, um... It's very buttery, like, smooth. As opposed to, like, this matte, which is still nice, but it's... it's a, this is a thicker matte. This is very, like... just feels like you flow over it. I like it. All right, so I'm trying to decide, should I go up or down? I feel like this week I need to get more done. So let's go ahead and go all the way to the edge. I really do like the colors in this kit. I have been hoarding it for November because my husband was like, it looks very Thanksgiving fallish with the colors and the art and so you should use it in November and I was like okay honey we we'll use it in November and I think he was thinking more along the lines of Thanksgiving <laughs> oh my light keeps going out I'm sorry y'all you probably can't even tell um but I waited. I waited till the first week of November. Sorry, honey. That's all I can wait. Plus, I have a Thanksgiving kit from Two Little Bees, and I cannot wait to use it. That will be interesting, though, because it's the first kit I've gotten from Two Little Bees, which is interesting because I keep stalking her shop because her stickers are so pretty. And if you guys have ever seen them, she has so many 
cute foxes. And if you know me, you know that I love a cute fox sticker. And so I've been stalking, like literally stalking her site, waiting for her to restock some things and put up new kits because uh, she just had a baby. If you didn't know, I found out that the hard way, which I'm very excited for her, but it meant that she took some time off from her shop. Which is fine. I mean, if I was having a baby, I'd take time off too. You can't have a baby and make stickers. like, Or if you can, you have like people helping you. Like you have a nanny or a sticker person or something. Like that's just not human. So I <laughs> completely don't blame her for wanting time off with her new baby. Like you at the very least have to snuggle the new baby. Like that bonding time is important. So, this is my favorite sticker. I'm trying to decide where to put it. I always want to put my favorite ones down here, which I don't understand. I think I'm off again this weekend. I'm going to put this one on Friday. And I've actually been taking these off. Oh, that light. Probably need to check my camera. I think part of what was wrong with it was that it didn't want to upload longer videos. So I think I probably need to check it because I think if I go too long, we'll have the same problem and I'm talking to myself for no reason, probably. You know. You know what I mean, Jolene? So let's go ahead and put these full boxes down and then I'll check it. I don't know why I just put this back in here. Sometimes, y'all, I do things that don't make sense. And by sometimes, I mean all the time. Let's go ahead and put this side down. Every little thing. I remember. So. Nice. These are like happy pledge sized. No, these are Erin Condren sized, I bet. Can't remember which one it is that fits like that. I'm gonna put this one up here. So the only thing, well not the only thing, but I don't think this kit has little things and I have been liking little things lately no it doesn't so we have a couple options I can pull some little things from an old kit that would work or or I could um, use some like half boxes but half boxes are just so big uh, not half boxes. That would be really big. I meant quarter boxes. <laughs> you people are probably like, yeah, Betsy, half boxes are really big. I really like this feather one. Do y'all see how pretty that is? So for the last couple weeks, I've been trying to find my rose gold work stickers. And I don't know where the heck I put them because I have not been able to find them for like forever. Yeah, forever is, is appropriate. So I think I'm going to have to go ahead and get some new ones. I need to just bite the bullet anyways because I think I only had two left. So I was going to have to buy new ones either way. But principle of the matter. Didn't want to get new ones till the old ones were gone. Darn it. I don't have sidebar stickers either, which honestly, like, I have not been using my sidebar anyways. I do use the habit tracker. Um, eventually I go back, you know, and <laughs> I always write in my big happy planner, which is like uh, what I've been using for a journal. And if even if I don't like write in it right away, I always go back and fill in the days that I miss.
These are all header size, I think. Yeah, okay, so I'll use those throughout the week. So let's just use two big ones. my phone. You guys are probably long gone and I'm talking to myself again. Probably. Honestly y'all, if that's happened, I'm just gonna like not film again this week. Because I don't know what to do about it. I feel like this girl should go right here. Yeah, that's cute. All right, I'm gonna check my phone real quick. Stay there. Ooh. All right, y'all. My camera got messed up. Um, it wasn't her fault, but my mother-in-law called me while I was uh, filming. And so that video is gone, which is fine. It wasn't her fault, like she had you really have no way of knowing if someone's filming. It's not like I can put a sign out that says filming, don't call me. You know what I mean? So like people are going to call. It's just that my stupid camera on my phone that that's what I'm using to film is uh, needs, I, I need a new phone except that I really don't need a new phone. Like my phone works fine. It just for some reason doesn't like to upload videos to the computer and I don't know why there's no good reason for it at all like everything else on my phone works perfectly fine but there is something wrong <sighs> something wrong with the camera so it is what it is y'all it is what it is I really want to put this here but then this line will stay out, which I don't like. I think I'm gonna have to move these around. So anyways, I, what I was saying was that when she called me, I was right in the middle of filming and so I don't know why, but I guess that messed up my phone. I don't really understand it, but I had a 13 minutes filmed basically Monday and Tuesday. And when I tried to put it on my computer, it says that the file uh, is corrupted. And like it can see that there's a file there, but it won't work on my computer, which is very frustrating. So we're gonna have to get a new, like I said, my phone's fine. We're gonna have to get a new camera. And I have an actual like DSLR camera, but it is older and it doesn't have video. So I really want a nice blogging video camera. And I was going to ask for one for Christmas because that would be awesome, right? That's kind of what I wanted. But my computer broke. Uh, my laptop not my desktop which doesn't make any sense because my desktop I bought in 2011 and my laptop I bought in 2016 I bought it I, I bought it for Christmas last year so there is no reason for my laptop to be broken but I bought it um online I didn't buy it from Apple I bought it from someone else Ooh, that kind of ripped my paper, which, I mean, it is what it is. And so I thought it was broken. It stopped working. I was very upset. But it turns out, I sent it to my um, dad because he, my stepbrother uh, works on computers. And he said he would look at it for me and see if there was 
anything we could do to get it working so I wouldn't have to buy a new one. And they looked at it and found out that my computer is fine. It is my charger that's messed up, which is kind of like the best news I've had in a while. So my dad actually decided that for Christmas this year, I know it's only November. My family is weird about holidays and he's already told me yesterday what he was going to get me because he has my laptop. So he said for Christmas, um, if I wanted, he would act, go ahead and pay my stepbrother to put in a new upgraded hard drive with more RAM and memory and all of that kind of stuff on my computer while they have it. And he's like, if that's not what you want, you know, we'll, we'll do something else. But I was like, um, yes, please. That sounds awesome. I'd way rather have a better, you know, blogging computer because that's what I use it for. And so I'm really excited. But means no new camera. So I have a couple options. I mean, I can still ask for a blogging camera, but... Let's be honest, um, my dad was the best chance I had at getting one. <laughs> uh, and I'm not trying to be mean, it's just, it, it is what it is. And that's fine, like I said, I don't need a blogging camera, I just, I wanted one. Um, so that my stupid videos would be better and faster and better quality and I could actually buy a tripod because my phone has problems connecting to a tripod so I use this tower thing and it's a whole to do and one day we'll get a blogging camera but I'm pretty sure nobody else in my family would buy me one my husband would but we don't have the money for it this year or I would have already bought myself one you know what I mean like we have the same money and while he's a sweetheart we just don't have the money for it right now. So we will see. I've not lost hope. My dad is very supportive of my blog. Um, last year, he knows that this is what I want to do, you know, full time. And I, I've been working very hard on, on getting the blog to be a full time job. And I'm getting closer every day, but it's it's a lot of work, you know, y'all know. And so he's very supportive of of that and of me, which is wonderful. And so my Christmas presents from him and birthday presents, anytime he gets me a present, is typically something that I've needed for the blog last year for Christmas. He bought me a Cricut machine because I had told my stepmom that I really wanted one so that I could start doing stickers. And so I've been working on, on getting sticker stuff ready. I'm gonna open my sticker shop, hopefully sooner rather than later. I'm hoping um, in January I'll finally be able to open that. And that would be excellent. That would be really exciting. <laughs> Um, and then for my birthday last year, he paid for my hotel at a blog conference I wanted to go to, um, Haven. I've gone twice now, but last year was the first year I got to stay in the hotel because he paid for it because I just, we just don't have that kind of disposable income. And that's that's fine like I said you can get away without stuff like that but it is very nice to be able to go to those kinds of things and and I'm very grateful that he understands my blogging dream because uh, he could definitely be one of those people that's just like well that's stupid um, you're not you're not ever gonna get anywhere you know or you're not ever gonna go far enough and you just need to give up and that is not him at all. That's really no one in my family. My mom is super supportive. She's always helping me with blog posts and with projects. 
and she's definitely my like partner in crime when it comes to this kind of stuff she's like on top of it she's always calling me and she's hilarious because um she has a gorgeous old home and she's always calling me and she's like betsy we could do this project betsy we could do that project and so she's very on top of helping me with like the content stuff whereas my dad he's not so crafty um at all he's an aeronautical engineer and works in the army space division is not crafty at all but he you know he used to come to my art shows and he supports my blog he supports me he just doesn't know how to you know knit something or put a sticker down that's fine you don't have to if that's not your thing but my mom is the one that I, I honestly get the sticker thing from. Well, maybe not the sticker thing. She hates the sticker. She's like, I don't understand how you even plan anything with all those stickers. It doesn't look functional. I would get so confused. But she's the crafty one. I got her a Cricut for last Christmas. Or her birthday. For Mother's Day. Because once she saw mine, she had to have one. <laughs> Uh, okay, y'all, I'm enjoying talking to y'all, but I need to check my camera. Alright, y'all, my, uh, works that time. I, I don't understand it. It's, like, half the time it works and half the time it doesn't. But I'm just going to keep going, even when I've got to upload the videos. I, I know that's not ideal, but it's, like, if you can't tell... I'm doing this so long the sun has gone down even and so if I keep waiting and stopping like we're just never gonna get done and I can't be here forever I mean I guess I could but I'd rather not like spend hours doing this and I feel like I already have been because I started at like 4 and it's 5:48 because I spend so much time I have to take the video and then I can't go if I go over like 12 or 13 minutes on my camera the video file gets corrupted and then I can't transfer it so I have to go 10 or 11 minutes and then transfer it and then the transfer takes X amount of time and it just it's it's a whole to do y'all a whole to do. I'm really loving this kit. Like the colors are just ah, love it. It's gonna be a small checklist. Damn it. I need to move that up. Well, y'all, you don't get to watch me move a bunch of crap around. You should be used to that by now. Apparently, that's all I do. <sighs> I'm loving all the rose gold. I have really missed rose gold the last couple weeks since I've basically not had any spreads with rose gold in them for a while. So the only bad part is I haven't really left any spots this week to put my work schedule. And partially that's because I just don't know my work schedule yet. We are basically down to two of us at the store right now because um, one of my part-timers left. I can't blame him. He, uh, he's working part-time while he was going back to school and then there his, his wife got pregnant with their second baby and we're all very excited for him. He's, he's very excited. Um, but it was hard enough, you know, to, to support a family of one child and a wife on part time, you know, that, that second baby kind of, it, it was too much. And so he had to go back to his old job, which makes going to school very difficult because they just, I'm not quite as work friendly, of course, as a part time job, but when you need the hours, you need the hours. So he 
he will make it work. He's very, very responsible, very hardworking, very driven. He's a good guy. And he will get through school and get the job he wants and they'll have their baby. So everything will be okay there. It just, he couldn't stay with us because we just, we just couldn't offer him full time. I wish we could. He would definitely be a good choice. He's a good, great worker, good guy. But we just don't have full-time positions, so makes offering someone full-time very difficult. Anyways, anywho. Um, just makes it difficult. So I don't know who, but someone out there doesn't want me to do Plan With Me videos. It's the only logical thing because my husband called now and messed up that Plan With Me video trial that I had. So, whatever. Just never, ever, ever going to get my plan with me is finished. <laughs> oh, I swear. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what else I have to put down. There's a little rose up top. It's pretty. Love this weekend banner. Hopefully I can put it down. Okay, I'm really bad at putting down weekend banners. I don't know what it is with them, but I always put them down crooked. And now that I've started, it's just gonna have to be crooked. Maybe there's some deco I can put. You know, sleeping in is important. I kind of want to use this. I've never done this before. Let's see how it looks. It's cute. Oh, I like it. Okay, good. Let's go back to looking at deco. I think maybe these little leaves. It's cute. I can just get it up enough to put this tiny corner and the Are you freaking kidding me? I just ripped it. I'm just, I need to be done. That's the only good thing about stickers is that even if you rip them, they're stickers. So you can kind of just put them back together. You know what I mean? I just put a little. Now look at that. I did all of that so that I could put this stupid thing under that weekend manner and now I'm going to cover it with a rose. <laughs> there we go. That's cute. Let me 
makes it a little more even. Maybe just in my brain. In my brain, it makes even. Oh, Betty, my dog. So my, my desk here is literally right behind the couch. Like the desk and the couch back up to each other. And so my dog is sitting on the couch, staring backwards over the couch at me. She doesn't usually do. So she must want some attention. I've not been paying you enough attention, sweetheart. Okay, so the question is, where am I gonna put this teepee? Because it is the cutest thing we got. And it's big, so I feel like it needs, it's gonna need a good amount of space, you know? Here, but I don't like that, so I'm gonna put it here. Yeah, that's cute. Okay. I wish I had like a little bird. Wouldn't that be cute? Like it was like flying over it. Just me that thinks that's cute. I think that would be cute. I can still write something in. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. So the problem is that I've got to put like fill up these spaces and have like all the deco on one side. I know that probably won't bug anyone else, but it will bug me. Oh, let's put this one here. It's cute. Yeah, I like that. Um, add some deco down there and the feathers go together. So I'm digging it. I need to put something here. these glitter headers and then I can fill in with whatever I need to fill in. I just want to cover up this line. It's bugging me. Alright, so I think y'all I am done. I still have one full box and quite a bit of stickers. I guess I just don't have a lot of sticker ways going on. This is cute though. Let's use this little teardroppy thing up here. Let's put it down a little bit. stuff in here but again I just don't really have anything for those times yet and there's really just no need to fill things in that I don't have any reason to so I would like to use this bag but I don't know it's not my favorite 
I don't think I'm going to use it. I'm going to put some of these little things on this, though. Because that would be cute. That would be cute. Sorry, y'all. The longer I do these, the like, more loopy I get. So, apparently I'm pretty loopy. I'm loving all the rose gold, though. So, I wish I knew... I worked, but I could put work here and here. That can work. Yeah, I'll use up my last two work days. That'll work. I wish, because I only have two, I can't put one for every day. But. Only bad part about these is as cute and delicate as they are, they have a pink background, which normally is fine. It's like every spread I ever do is like pink. But this week it is not pink. The rose gold still works, so I'm still gonna use them. But oh yeah, I forgot I had the other one of those. Perfect. Okay, so. I need to fit that in somewhere. I can do it. I just gotta think. Let's go ahead and put this one here. That'll fill up that spot. This one, I think, over here. Yeah. Yeah, like right there. I'll just write it on that. That will work. That will work just fine. Oh, it's kind of crooked. I know y'all, you're like, just put the sticker down already. Oh, so I forgot. Um, I think I was telling y'all about something and during the segment that got corrupted. So I'm going to finish telling you about it. I got a new traveler's notebook this week. Or I ordered one. It's not here yet, but it will be. So, um, Glitter and Chai, Grumpy Bear. I know she's not Glitter and Chai anymore. She's just Grumpy Bear Studios, and she does really cute Grumpy Bears. But I started buying from her when she was Glitter and Chai, and, like, I love her rose gold stuff. And so that's just what I remember her as. Um, but anyways, Megan from Grumpy Bears put out a collab with 1407 this week. That was literally <sighs> Grumpy Bear Traveler's Notebook goodness. Like, honestly, y'all. So much good goodness. And so I'm just gonna put the clean one down. So I'm sure we'll have something to clean next weekend. I fell in love. I don't need any new Traveler's Notebooks. I have two, and if you look at my May Designs post, that's my big traveler's notebook, it has a picture of my... Th I'm pretty much done, which is excellent. Um, I have a couple things to add in, but other than that, I mean, I kind of love how it turned out. This may be my favorite week in a while, <laughs> so... I'm going to just add a couple uh, day off sticker to my two days off, which I don't really need the days off, like stickers. I, I know which days I'm off, trust me, like 
nobody needs to remind me about that but got them they come with the work stickers that I like so might as well so do need to add oh don't want to do it but I'm gonna have to kind of am in love with how this turned out. I need to order new work stickers from Simply Watercolor Co. But honestly, I'm probably going to do that like right now. <laughs> Let's just add it here. Because technically this was my stuff that I bought sticker for this week so I'm kind of absolutely in love with this like absolutely in love I was looking to see if I had a little like buy sticker or something but I don't see one. Maybe I have one on the white one. Date night, target run. Oh, I do have a sleep in sticker, but I already used one. That would have been cute though. Apparently I have payday, but not like, go buy useless things you don't need. Come on, I mean, why wouldn't I? I think I've got one on here. Like I at least have many things that I could add, like a little, I need to add these. So, I absolutely love this. Oh, before I was cut off that last time, I was telling y'all about the traveler's notebook I got. So it's a pocket size like this one, but it's Grumpy Bear. Oh my God, y'all, it's gonna be so cute. And so it's all Christmas Grumpy Bear, like tangled in lights. And it, I got the, the cover and inserts. I think it came with two inserts, so I'll have to get more inserts for it eventually, but I'm not sure what I'm gonna use it for other than Christmas stuff. So I just got two inserts and it comes with one and then I got one extra. And then I got well, I didn't get it. The, the kit comes with like some clips and die cuts and um, papers and vellums and everything. And so this traveler's notebook and this one are my two normal ones. I have blog posts up on both of these. I'll link those below so y'all can see them. And I love them. I'm really digging them. I've only had them for a couple weeks now, but I'm loving them. I think I, they're gonna really help me next year. Um, my main planner, you know, that I plan like my entire weekend is great and helps keep me on track for like day to day. But then my product planner and the other ones, my on the go planner, it's just lists and to do things and kind of like my brain dump, like my brain needs to just like blah, everything out in one place. And then I can organize it according to like, oh, well, this day I need to do this. And this is my priority for this day. But um, it's really working well for me. So I'm loving it. And I really love how this turned out. I added a couple little things to those weird places that worked out really well. And oh, see, look at this Happy Meal package. Um, those are from these paper blush bar little kits and they are so cute. They are so little. I love them. I love all the foiling and I just really like this week. This week can be every week. I'm just going to use this kit every week. Okay, guys? So you don't need to watch any more of my plan with me. This is it. This is what I'm going to do every week. Okay. Glad we figured that out. Until next time, when maybe I do this exact same kit. No. I love it, though. I'm just going to stare at it for a while. I was watching a YouTuber a couple days ago, 
and it was um, on weird things that planner addicts do and she said petting a perfectly laid out spread and oh my god yes okay I hope y'all are gonna have a great day and a good night and I love you thanks for watching subscribe to see more weird rambly videos from me about stickers and have a great week bye y'all